Do you find yourself constantly worrying or wondering if your pain's gonna get actually worse? Uh, my name is Dr. Chad Coons, and I wanna hop on and just talk about this topic today because it's one of those that needs to be, I think, thrown out in the air, uh, needs to be spoken of more often because so many times I think in general, healthcare providers are looking to just fix the problem without providing a full storyline of actually what's going on. I know for myself too, if I have pain when something comes up, I need to kind of identify what it is and have a story behind it. And this is the same thing that I try to do with my clients. Otherwise, you don't even know what kind of uh, war you're fighting in. I tell my clients this all the time. Imagine you're on the forest. I say, all right, well, uh, let's just say it's because of tight muscles and that's causing your pain, which by the way is even a better story than none. But you can kind of see the lackluster uh, effect of that, right? So if you're in the forest and I say, go fight the war, it's because of tight muscles, you're kind of like, well, I don't really know what's causing it. Why are my muscles tight? I know they're tight, but you know, why? Uh, versus what if we say, well, here's the nerve that's going through your muscles, that's causing the tightness. Um, in the example of that forest, we can say, look at the right in front of you. That's what we need to attack. You know where we need to attack opposed to wondering who's gonna come and kind of blindside you. That's kind of what happens uh, in our brains. We need to know exactly what's going on and why and where it's at and the plan of attack. If you don't have that, I oftentimes see people catastrophizing, meaning they're making things worse than it really is, and that's just human nature. It's, it's survival, it actually boils down to mobility, right? If you're having pain, let's say, in your shoulder and you fear that it's gonna to continue to get worse, now I'm down to one arm, that's just at our survival level because we've been wandering this earth for thousands of years and it's been all about survival and it will continue to be that for a long time and therefore we get caught up uh, in this trap, in this web of catastrophizing or fear of it getting worse. So if you're in that position, guys, you, you can't really sleep at night, find someone that you can really trust or maybe you're already treating and working with someone, have them tell you the why so that you can sleep at night. Keep asking like a little child would, why, why, why? So that you get the story that you need. So that in the purpose of again in this analogy, if you're in the forest and you're fighting this war, you know exactly where they're at. Because I know I would feel a lot better about that. They go, there it is, they're, they're the people I need to attack and they're right there. I know there's no one else around me. Versus, I don't really know what's going on. You never really told me. And I feel like I could get blindsided from anywhere. So sure, it feels like it could get worse. So. I really want to hop on and talk about this. There's a lot more we could keep going, but um, I hope that helped, guys. And please feel free to also reach out uh, and email me, or you can even direct message me here, whatever works best for you. Thanks, guys. Take care.